Thank you, Stream Elements, for letting me know that I am live. Alright, I'm kind of surprised. One Way Heroics actually got an update today? What? What's the update? There have been several big internal changes, including an upgrade to the game engine, so if you encounter any problems or notice anything strange during gameplay, please contact us here on Steam Forums. Overall processing speed and startup time have been improved, however, in-game text will now be rendered in Unicode UTF-8. Characters that are incompatible with the font will still not display properly. The game now behaves differently on the character naming screen. Now you can continue typing even if you exceed the character limit. When you press enter to confirm, the text will be cut off. Okay.
Hello, Pavlino1250. Aw, thank you for the follow. I super appreciate it. <laughs> Doing halfway decent. Um, I don't know. I, I figured that we're, we're slowly making our way forward. I've actually been doing a lot of development stuff on the back end for having new emotes. And uh, I, as of this week, just wrapped up doing five new hairstyles for my, my VTuber. And... Uh, retouched four previous outfits made five new ones and i'm still in the process of like fine-tuning a bunch of those but feeling pretty good about stuff we beat a couple games recently and uh we have plans to beat a couple more because there's <laughs> there, there's still a few of them that we're, we're gonna go back to and take a look at um and yeah i just haven't really been sure on what it is i want to do for tonight it's kind of an open evening i didn't have enough time to put up a community vote unfortunately so it's just like well i do roguelikes i do a lot of roguelikes alternatively a uh, bit of an emulation and maybe minecraft but i'm having a kind of a low energy emotional day um weather isn't helping my my ribs are killing me and if you weren't aware already i am a chronic pain patient so usually struggling in some manner with that let's see oh of course of course the timer runs up just as i'm about to start rolling a thing hello everyone hi 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 <laughs> hope you're all having a lovely evening uh you all get to deal with me still doing some things before we're actually going to start here oh god blast myself in the face of the light um blah 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 I had a lovely evening, though, tonight, getting a chance to talk with my sister. Uh, she lives out of state from where I'm at, and so we don't get to really chat in person very often. And even, like, online, like, it's it's only ever little bits and pieces of catch-up, so getting a chance to sit down at a, at a meal together and just talk work, talk life, it was nice. <sighs> and it's, I don't know. The world is changing around me, and I've been a little secloistered lately in a way that's... Mm, I should probably do some self-re-education on just the state of things outside of the, the fields that I have my special interests in. Just kind of realizing that. Because when, I, when it comes down to it, like, all I think about now, all I think about now is this streaming, hanging out with you folks, uh, creating content, doing the the things that I always wanted to do in theater, whether it was community theater or stage theater uh, back when I was in school, just the things that I couldn't do otherwise. And it's <clears throat> good to be able to focus like that, but I've also done so to the detriment of, well, I have zero clue what's going on on a lot of fronts around the world. I'm usually like to be a bit better educated than that. Oh. So, what I've got queued up right now, because I was talking about it the other night, is a uh, Half Minute Hero and One Way Heroics, both of which are inspired by the game that we just beat last night, Dragon Quest. 
the original, um, but are obviously roguelike, so they're very much not the same kind of game even, they're just heavily inspired in elements. Also, hello Colt, good to see you, hon. We have arrived. We have arrived? Ah, uh, is there a party watching me? <laughs> Cheers, folks. All right. Now that that's all put together, I am running out of counter space. Party! We also had a very emotional day with the computer hardware because I did an upgrade and watched as after my my hair my hair flipped over my shoulder. No way! No way! Hell yes! I'm sorry. I've been like messing with the uh, the options in Vroid for a minute as the first time that I've managed to get physics simulations to actually occur inside of VC face that that was interesting um but yeah we got some hardware upgrades done and I stuck in four times as much RAM into this thing as it started with and then it wouldn't boot and it just sat there for a while and so I took that RAM out, and I put the old RAM back in, and I tested it, and it booted back up. And I'm like, hmm, that's interesting. And then I shorted out my leash against the motherboard. And then I took the old RAM back out, and I put the new RAM in. And I turned it on, and it didn't boot. And it just sat there, and I'm like, oh no, I've killed my machine. And so I get on my phone, and I start just reading for a while, and I'm trying to figure out what I'm going to do, because I'm like, I don't know if I actually just fried the thing, or if it's something that I did with the RAM, or if I need to go replace the RAM, or if I bought the wrong kind of RAM, or if I needed to go into, like, the UEF, UEFI bias and tell it in advance that I needed to put the RAM in. I didn't know what the situation was. And after, like, 12 minutes of me just, like, cruising around on the net, trying to find answers, and sitting in front of what I thought was a dead PC, she boots right up in front of me. No problem. It just needed time in, in the BIOS to actually do the check on the new RAM. And it hadn't occurred to me that, like, that might take a second because of the acceleration of technology, but this is also, I want to say, like, four times as much RAM as I've ever put into any PC, and this is DDR5, so this architecture is drastically different from the DDR2 I was working with back in the day. Uh, things have moved along. <laughs> <laughs> Let's see if that game is done installing. Oh, also my alarms are going off. Uh, okay. This is probably going to be loud, so my apologies. Marvelous AQL. Huh? Oh no, I completely missed that intro. Well, that sucks. Look at the fish in a second. I don't remember this being this awesome, but hell yeah! <laughs> An epic battle has begun. With the evil lord's arrival, the world will be destroyed. What awaits the young new hero on the dangerous road ahead? Save the world in 30 seconds. Uh... 
Oh no, I don't remember how to even play this. Okay. Uh, Hero's Departure. Con confirm? Fastest clear time, 37 seconds. Play logs longer than two minutes are not saved. Okay. Hero, looks like you're going to play this part. As a special bonus, I reset the time to when you first came here. But equipment you got after the stage cannot be used here. You'll cause a big time paradox if you bring in stuff from the future. Do you want to start as is? Great. You might as well take this chance to try out new things, or test to see how fast you can beat the evil lord. Good luck! I don't remember how to play! In the beginning, there was only time. And in that early stage, two gods collided. The Time Goddess, Mistress of Time, and the Ultimate Evil Lord, Destroyer of Worlds. Their battle lasted for eons, but finally ended. Weakened, the Ultimate Evil Lord was sealed. Ruby, the Time Goddess's power source, was crushed. And now, humans were born into this world and flourished. The Goddess has emerged many times to save humans, and the first year she descended, the humans called it the last year of the Goddess Era. Many goddess statues were erected in worship, but in the shadows of this bright era, the hatred of the ultimate evil lord seeped through and created beings that would wreak havoc. This is the story of a young man who in the goddess era 100 would become the hero, a true champion against evil. I need to change my uh, category here, one moment. Do, 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 do. All right, Hero's Departure. Bring a tutorial message? Yes, I do not know what I'm doing. Hmm, I better do something about this. What a pain, there has to be a better way. There's one, perfect pawn. Huh? A small island of Strel is where a young traveler arrived. Hero! Welcome to my kingdom! I hear that you need some support to continue traveling. I don't mind giving you some, but would you do something for me? Some monsters have appeared on the nearby plains. They're wreaking havoc on the villages around here. I want you to punish those grass fiends. There are a total of three. Good luck, hero. Oh, no! No, I messed up everything. I was trying to hit escape to open the options so I could turn this down. Oh, this is already turned down. Okay, one sec. I hit escape and it just like blasted through all the text. That's a problem. That's a major problem. <laughs> Let me... There we go. Uh... Huh? Healing. Purchase items. Talk, check, hold to dash. Huh? See? The food store is in the middle. Purchase food from the store to heal health on the spot. There's so many fiends around, I get attacked at every turn. Welcome! Buying food will heal your health. There's a creepy castle southeast of here. Something's going on there. Huh? Auto. Uh, battle monsters? Use items... Flee. Battle with monsters are on auto. When you want to avoid battles, press and hold left and right. When you have an item, you can use it with S. What the hell? I will be watching you from here. Please take care of the grass fiends. Are these the grass? Oh, those are the grass fiends. Okay. Defeated grass fiends. Okay. I must say, um, after watching that mini documentary about like hyper casual games, this feels bad. This feels really bad. <laughs> As expected, you are very good. The king will be overjoyed. See so defeat of the monsters. Now go and report your triumph to the king. Thank the goddess. Now the island will be safe. 
Thank you, hero. You did well. And now for your reward. Slaps you in the face. What's that? What's going on? Ha 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 ha! Looks like I surprised you! To the king and all humans! I just discovered a spell of awesome power that can destroy the world! With this spell, the world will be doomed in 30 seconds! Foolish humans, enjoy what little remains of your wretched lives! Ha 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 ha! Farewell! <laughs> By the goddess, we must go! Defeat the evil lord immediately! Oh no. This is really, really bad. This is very bad. And I don't mean- wait, what? Okay. Oh, I died. Uh. I I think I understand it now. It's 30 seconds, the world is doomed! So how did I do that in 32 seconds, then? Hella? Hello? Wake up, hero! Whoa. Nice to meet you, hero. I'm the time goddess. As my name suggests, I'm a goddess that controls time. What is a powerful goddess like me? What with a dirty traveler? That's right, I'm here to offer you a little proposal. Evil Lord learned a spell that can doom the world in 30 seconds. You're fast, but not fast enough to stop the Evil Lord. The world is doomed at this rate. What should I do? It's where you come in. Want the goddess service? If you don't have enough time, I can rewind time just enough. You can also shorten the time you need to grind. Sounds too good to be true? You're a sharp one. Well, I love money. I'll help you, but you're going to give me the money you get. You pay me for my services. It's all about give and take. Do you want to bring... Do you want to accept my proposal to bring about world peace? What happens if I say no here? <laughs> I completely understand why you want to say no, but was there an, ever an RPG that moved on by selecting no? Besides, the world has been doomed. You don't have any other choice. Oh, okay. It's a deal. For starters, I'll turn back time to when the spell was first cast. I'll give you some other bonuses to look forward to then. I hope we'll have a profit, I mean, fulfilling relationship. By the goddess, we must go defeat the evil lord immediately! Uh, okay. You came to defeat me. You're not getting in my way. I'll squash you like a bug. Slap. I was so close to finishing casting the spell of destruction. Wow, you were really close. But it's too late. He will be spreading the spell of destruction all over the world. Even if you defeat me, there will be countless others. Enjoy what little time you have left. <laughs> So there are mechanics to this. Accept this caravan as thanks. It should help you on your journey. I suppose it's time to bid farewell. I wish you luck on your travels. What does that mean? Please wait, hero. Here's a little something for you. It's a bit old, but I hope you'll make good use of it. Take care. Hero got tatty tags? Good job for now. It's all thanks to me, but you did well in your own right. Oh, but shortening your grind time will reset your level after a day. There are always side effects to convenient powers. Anyway, somebody is spreading around that spell of destruction. At this rate, there's going to be new evil lords allowed to destroy the world. That would be bad, don't you think? We have to go and stop those evil lords together, hero. Come on, cheer up. Let's go, hero. She just wants money. <laughs> oh, that's amazing. All right, everyone. That's the game. Um, <laughs> let's see. 
Uh huh. Uh huh. Hmm. Oh no, don't send that to the leaderboards. I did terribly. And thus the traveler hero gained the help of the time goddess and brought peace to the land. But what if the evil lord said was true? But if what the evil lord said was true, there will be other evil lords that will cast the spell of destruction. With the caravan given by the king, he sets out to new lands. Next time on Hero 30, Continental Bridge. Hmm. Hello, hero. Good work today, really. It'll be a while until we can punish all those who use the destruction spell, but I hope we'll get along. To reflect on what happened today, just talk to me. I'm sure it'll be useful for you. Huh. You and I will make a great team. My name is Nozal the 30th. Everyone calls me Professor. I will discover and explain all that exists in this world. I will also explain to you the mysteries of the world. Uh, okay. Hello, I'm Aisha. I joined the caravan because I wanted to see the world. The path ahead should lead us to many different worlds. If there's a fort pass, I'll be sure to tell you. Hello, hero. I'm Norian, the leader of this caravan. I traveled the world in the past, and I believe I can give you valid advice in the future. Pleased to make your acquaintance. Huh. Strain Forgotten? What does that mean? Oh. <laughs> Two Continental Bridge. That was the whole thing. Hello, hero. Looks like we're in for the long haul. Remember what the evil lord said? Someone is spreading the destruction spell to others. Looks like there's an evil lord that learned the spell on this continent. But there. I shut myself in for thirty years, and I have no other good points. But some traveling old man taught me the spell of destruction. I broke the bridge so no one can interfere with me. Perfect. Now the world will end in just 30 seconds. Looks like that's it. It's our turn to do something and let's save the world again. You want to fix the bridge first to get to the evil lord's castle. Let's gather info at the village and find someone that can fix it. Oh, and if you want to turn back time, go to the goddess statue. It's not ethically right for me to turn back time so often. But I still want lots of money. I'll tell you more when you get to the village, hero. Hmm. In the center is the goddess statue. Beautiful, just like me. Pay money and pray to turn back time up to 30 seconds. But every time you use it, the amount of money you'll need will increase. Why does it cost money? Because time is money! Don't sweat the details. Don't worry. Be happy. Uh-huh. Hey, you! Listen to what my husband has to say. I tried to fix the broken bridge, but monsters stole my hammer. They went to the East Cave. You might find it if you go now. Oh, okay. Welcome. Heal your HP here.
Three seconds left to beat myself. Oh. Huh. You got my hammer back. Thanks. I'll fix the bridge right away. Now my husband can work again. Del delightful. Yep. I fixed the bridge thanks to you. Take care. Herbs can be used to heal during battle. Handy. The bridge is fixed. Now I can eat seaweed salad in the eastern village. Ooh, bronze, bronze sword. Tasty. Our sword is on sale. Shields up your avoidance rate. Very nice. The plan to destroy the bridge ended in failure. But, 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 don't think you can beat me yet. I knew it. I used up too much of my strength destroying the bridge. Darn you to heck. <laughs> the Gary attack! <laughs> West cleared. Excuse me, wait! Thanks for getting my hammer back. I wanted to thank you, so I came after you. Take this with you. Good luck on your journey. Got the bamboo spear. Nice. You did a hero. You saved the world again. But we still didn't find the way the guy spreading the spell of destruction. Until we find him, more and more evil lords are learning the spell. This is going to be a long journey. Pull yourself together, hero. I need to take some headache medicine because my head is killing me. Oh, uh, we'll let the credits here run. This is so silly that they do it for every single... Because, like, I'm assuming that the levels get longer. I don't remember. I, I apparently played this up to a certain point for a few hours way back in the day. I feel like 2014. Pro tip, don't take your estradiol with um, uh, Rockstar. That's stuck to the roof of my mouth in the worst way, but it kind of tasted minty. I got kelp lover. What does that mean? Are these achievements? The path closed off by the evil lord. Hero gave the carpenter his hammer. The bridge was reconstructed. The evil lord was then soundly defeated. He actually fixed a bridge with one hammer? He's much more amazing than an evil lord. Next time on Hero 30, Lord Hadiers. Hadiers? Hadiers? This area has rich deposits of precious gems. We finally crossed the continent. I can't wait to see what's in store for us. I heard there's a tough mercenary around here. Interesting. Barely. What does barely mean? Is it like a timing thing? This one I got both. Red diamond and ear killer. Huh. Okay, okay, yes. Thank you. Someone was here just now learning to cast the spell destruction, and my fiendish ears heard it all. Now to find it out for myself. Oh no. Could you be a sweetie and put him in his place before he casts that spell? It takes 30 seconds to complete it. Spare the town a visit. Jeeves. That bridge nearby is crawling with monsters. Best watch yourselves. Hey, you think you got a problem you need solved. Me? I'm a soldier for hire. I could give you a hand for the right price. A thousand gold and I'm your man. If you can afford that. Hmm. Tell you what, I've been looking for a present for my girlfriend, but I got no idea what to give her. So bring me something that'll make her happy and I'll help you out. Okay. Today's meal is on the house. Eat as much as you want. Sure would be nice to have a mercenary like that in your party, huh?
They say there's diamonds in the cave up there. My boyfriend's a mercenary. Lately, he's been so cold and distant. If you had a ship, you could sail to that island. Sugar rice. Nom 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 nom. This is such a strange game. Yo, you got the goods I need? What's this? Yeah, this ought to make her happy. All right, then. I'll help you out just like I promised. Mercenary Yohei joined. You know what? We'll take the, the mystery loaf as well. Pray here. What's that? You need a ship? I'll take you, but not for free. That's 200 gold sound. Alright, the ship's all yours. I'll be waiting outside the village to ferry you to the island. You can now sail the ship. No sense going out on an empty stomach. Here, have something to eat. Rumor has it there's a weapon that works against the evil lord with sensitive ears. What do you think? This evil lord is notorious for his keen ears. Oh, this... Oh. Whoa! Huh? Why did that spawn me over there? Twenty two seconds left to beat myself. I just need to get there. I don't know. You sure you don't want to leave while you still can? I just one-shotted him. Oh, why did I think playing with the spell of destruction was a good idea? Dang. Quest cleared. So there's a lot of exploration and franticness about this. Hey, wait up! Thanks to you, the world's been saved from destruction. Take this. It's the least I can do. Well, I better go. My boyfriend's coming. See ya! Ooh, mercenary shield. I wonder if you even thought about what would happen if he actually did the spell destruction. Oh well, you stopped him, and that's what really matters, right? Is it? New record. Nice. Wonderful hero. What a silly little game. Pinning back the years of the evil lord, Hiro set sail for the next continent. Somewhere in the back of his mind, Hiro felt a little sorry for the evil lord. But that feeling didn't last too long. Next time on Hero 30, Caves and Forests. Good work. Let's keep this up. Cup a shield to lower critical hits from enemies. I love being on a ship. I just wish I could sail off to somewhere. There's nothing but bugs in the forest ahead. Interesting. Fasting. We're just going to skip and see some of these other ones I, I was on, apparently. Madwood! He got power from him. He only got lumbered anyway. He destroy world. Forest monsters, attack! Attack all! Oh, here's time, goddess. Hey, hero! Hey, hero, someone cast the spell again. The castle's deep in the forest, but there's a river here. You gotta cross the bridge. If you get to the village, the evil lord the evil lord castle will be close. Watch out for the forest. I hear weird voices from it. Now then, just take it easy.
Hmm. An axe. And a shield. I'm Richard. I'm a bard. The wolf is my partner, Robin. Hello, Robin. Rawr. You plan on going through the forest? Ever since the evil lord appeared, it's been called the evil forest. Recently, strong monsters roam both day and night. Here's the deal. If you're afraid of going alone, I can escort you to the next village. Terrible at fighting, but Robin here can knock them out cold. But it'll cost you. Let's see here. If you can pay 300 gold, it'll be a great help to me. If you're willing, let's do it. Okay. Looks like we're going to be grinding for a sec. Oh, that eats my health. I didn't realize that. I am a fool. Thanks. Sorry, being an artist has its costs. Let's go. Richard joined. All right. Uh-oh. Destroy. Oh, I messed that up. Retry. Hey there, Nyan Gosling. How's it going? Still need to get money for the axe and the shield. Well, the music for that is weird. ask you something. You want to fight the evil lord? Well, I'm writing a song that's based on the hero's journey. Come on, give me a few pointers. Tell me about your travels on the way over. Uh-huh, you met the king, and then? Well, you did more than just run fast. You really went through a lot. Come on, our partnership ends at the village. I know you'll feel sad with me gone, but a promise is a promise. Go on, get. Oh, okay. Looks like we're at the next village. Not much here. Looks like this is it. Robin, go on. Say goodbye to the hero. Oh. <laughs> Come on. Robin usually likes me. Farewell, hero. Think I'll be seeing you real soon. It is so weird actually being able to utilize, like, my dog noises on purpose, on stream, like, in character as a dog. Feels good. Feels real good. 
Ever since monsters started living in the forest, not many people come anymore. Mushy mushroom. You must be tired. How about a drink? We don't get many customers. Okay, yeah. Give me the mushroom. Slap. Don't interfere. Slap. Only a little more. Quest cleared. What? Oh, okay. Frank, true hero. Hmm. That's the thing is, like, it's a silly, silly game mechanically, but somebody actually did take the time to try and put plot into this, as weak as it is. With the help of a traveling bard and his wolf, Hero passed the forest and beat the tree. For some reason, Hero wants a pet now. Aw, same. I also want pets. Good work. Let's keep this up. According to my data, there's a rare bat and rat monster around here? I like forests, but now I'm bored. I want to see some other things. The fire tribe is ahead. They're brave people. Huh. Rumble! There's a rock there! Now I can cast the spell of destruction in peace! Hooray for in inorganic life! Rumble! <laughs> well, there's trouble, hero! The evil lord is casting! What's, what's the problem? Take a look! A rock is blocking the path! You can't get to the castle! Anyway, good luck! With the... Goddess, what the hell? Move the rock! The rock was blocking the way to the castle. It was put there by the fire tribe. Lavish mail. Plus two attack. Mountain stew. Whoa! Those nearly killed me. Pricey herb. This is all I will sell to outsiders. And the summit is a holy place. The rock protects that place. This mountain is holy to the fire tribe. Outsiders must go. You want to go through to save the world? No foreigner is allowed at the summit. But we like brave people. Go east to the Path of Trials and get the Valor Medal in the cave. When you get the Valor Medal, we'll allow you to reach the summit. Oh, okay. I'll guide you there. Come to the big rock in the path. Okay. Your courage will be tested. See ya! Uh, okay. Path is cut off. Hot lava flows in front of you. Cross anyway? Yep. Cross the lava. Mysterious voice. Wait, are you the one that took the Valor Medal without permission? Leave the medal here and go. You will not be punished if you obey. Leave the Valor Medal and run. No. Behold my true power. Mere human. It is now too late to beg for forgiveness. Your courage is true. No amount of threatening made you budge. You are the true hero. The Valor Medal is perfect for you. Okay. Now go. There's a monster that has gold on the first plane. Good job. Now take the Valor Medal and check the North Monument. The path will open. Whoa! Alright.
Is it actually possible? Like, I'm gonna pay attention to the... 64 gold. 58 gold. 62 gold. You moved the rock and came all the way, but your journey ends here! This is just somebody playing with a bunch of sprites. I'm actually tempted to- yeah, like, thanks Hyper Casual Gaming, let's just fuck- let, let's fly through this. Let's just cruise on through. Fluff be damned. Show me the mechanics and stop stopping me along the way. I don't care about your leaderboards. There aren't any. Yeah? Cactus out of desert juice. Desert juice out of cactus. Words. Climb a mountain with you. I feel a little jealous. There are monsters with lots of money. Fight them for riches. I never did find that monster. Uh-huh. Uh-huh. I'll figure it out. <laughs> you. Be careful. The desert up ahead can mess with your sense of direction. If you get the wrong path, you get sent back to the village. There's no shortage of travelers that try to go through the desert. Those people all say you should talk to the path with cacti. You should talk to the path with cacti. Was it take the path with cacti? That lizard just tore me up. I went the way with less cacti and I got sent back to the village. I came all the way here looking at the cacti, but now what? Seedless melon. It's seedless, so you can eat it right away. Eats the entire melon. This is bad. The Barbara took my spear, but she refuses to pay me for it. Who are you? I'm Barbara. I'm a pretty famous warrior around here. Seems to how you're here. Something's probably up. The evil lord is a snake charmer. Watch out for those snakes. How about it? Why don't you hire me? If you pay me 250 gold for my equipment, I'll help you hunt those snakes. Alright. Wait here a second. I'm gonna go pay for this stuff right now. Okay, I'm back. Now let's go. By the way, I'm only gonna help you until we're past the desert. Keep that in mind. You came to the desert, but you're gonna die. Arise with the trill of my flute. Go, my beauties! Oh, you snaky little... Oh, my! <laughs> Yay, we earn things. It's all irrelevant. Balanced hero. Huh. Alright. Wow. Okay. Unrelenting through the maze-like desert. Hero gained the help of Barbara. Uh-huh. Village in danger is the next one. We're just gonna leave and not even read. Because that's what we've made it to at this point. 
Uh huh. Whatever. Thank you, Dragon Lord. What's in here? Hi. The evil lord can destroy all sorts of stuff with his lightning. A scholar went west to research the evil lord's castle. Raffae. I would like that. Yikes! Lightning bun. The man in the tent recently faced the evil lord, but now he's... My buddy here is a strong warrior. After hearing about the evil lord, he went all the way here and even found a secret path to the castle. For when he got to the castle, the evil lord... He hit him with a bolt of lightning. My buddy went kaboom. Please, you have to get his medicine for him. If he gets better, he'll remember where the path is. Uh-huh. Get medicine. I searched a lot about herbs. Would you like to try one? Some guy went to the evil lord's castle recently. I hear he went south. Medicine? I have some in the tent. Go take it. Got medicine. And the town. Village is destroyed. Hero handed over the medicine. Oh, I can feel it in my veins. That's concerning. I'm all better now. I don't know who you are, but thanks. I've had enough of getting blown up. But if you want to go to the castle, I'll show you the path outside. Oh, I'm not making it. Oh, almost. Okay, so there's a mechanic to that of if you don't get to it fast enough. <laughs> I think I have to, yeah, retry. That, uh... That was rough. That's rough, buddy. Lightning has no effect on you. Well done. 
<laughs> we are changing games. I can't. I can't keep this up. This is so bad. <laughs> I now understand why I only played this for like an hour or so. <gasps> uh, this is criminally simplified. And like, as an introductory to RPGs, I could easily see this being interesting, but it's so frantic and utilizes mechanics that are like borrowed straight out of mobile games that are designed to like here's an ad break where instead they threw in the leaderboard thing and it's oh i can see right through the veil and it, it's nearly insulting <laughs> yes someday someday i'll i'll be able to slow down enough for this but uh if i do somebody check on me Let's let's try the other one. One Way Heroics. Something I previously played on stream and greatly enjoy. It is also simplified. And after you have to, after having played Dragon Quest, it uh definitely feels away. <laughs> See, was it full screen was how I had the setup? Oh no, that didn't work. OBS, hey, 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 OBS. This one also has really pretty music inherently. Um, oh, okay, this one, for reasons unknown to me, uh, what on earth? Fine, fine. You wanna you wanna play that way? Fine. Ugh. I win. No, that that didn't work. Bloody hell. I'm struggling. My apologies, folks. Yeah, I get to choose to either have it off to one side, slightly canted from the right or the left, but never never truly dead center. OBS, what is your problem? <laughs> <laughs> All right, let's play a game. Fancy the Bard. Because I have yet to beat this as the Bard. And I like the Bard. We were set up with a basic starter loyal pet. Which, by the end of the game, we actually don't want the pet. Pocky's very weak. <sighs> hmm... Hmm. Because we could swap out Loyal Pet for higher strengths. We'll just do this as it is. New Random World. New Items and Partners in Grueling Campaign, which I think is what we have to play on. The Bard Elysia swings her axe of reckless abandon, desperately trying to destroy the stone wall in front of her. The reason why is obvious. The dark that is consuming the world is right at her heels. And the only way out of this dungeon is to escape by destroying the wall blocking her path. Whether she makes it out or not, there's a lesson to be learned here. Somehow my body, which should have been defeated by tough harpies, returned to me in one piece. Actually, maybe it isn't. My memories of my old body are already fading. And that's all I have to say about that. Our land is destitute, and we are unable to lend you any help. Please do your best anyway. I know it will be a tough journey, but we leave the destruction of the Demon Lord up to you, Fancy. I'll be leaving this castle behind as well. I hope we're able to eat meet once more. Now, it is time to depart. I pray for your success. Why game loud? Game so loud. Why game so loud when I have it turned down? Wow. That's a little too quiet. <laughs> Turn that down on my headphones instead so that you folks get all the volume you want and I can still hear myself. Because intonation is important. Resonance is important. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Hello. Yes, I'll take you with me. 
Don't be weird, though. Thank you, Soldier D. You, I'm not going to take any loot from you because I know I'm going to lose. We're going to do a fresh start. Wow, that's a lot of mountains. Current level is two. Give me more weight limit, please. But now, oh no! Spot just got one-shotted. Well, we traded Spot for four more uh, item limit. Yay! Hello, random bat. Is that a minotaur? Whoa! That minotaur just... Ruined me. One shot from full health to nothing in an instant. Oh, and I need to change this from happening here to one-way heroics. Same. I kind of want to get the plus edition of this now that I know that there's like more stuff that you can do. But I know that it also changes the way that the, the game plays. <laughs> Uh, yeah, 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 yeah. I didn't know that that enemy was that strong. New adventure. New world. That one was rough. You see that? The hero just got gobbled up by darkness. Ah, if that idiot had moved diagonally right there, escaping would have been a piece of cake. <laughs> Imagine if somebody was just... Yelling that in a bar, like, oh, if that guy moved diagonally. No, not dash. Ugh. What's in the dimensional vault? What do we have here? I realize now that I've actually got a lot of stuff. And I can always put things back if I die. I just need to remember to do so. Uh... Buddy tablets are fun. Turns out you can use them to uh, deal characters. Wait a sec. I already grabbed it, okay. Alright, so we started in a desert. Why does this look like the desert that we were stuck on the last time I was doing a run? 
Because, like, these are procedurally generated. Did I just happen to... Nope, that's not a town. That is a dungeon. That's a different... That's so weird. Oh no, oh no. Well, I messed that up. <laughs> Wait, did I just put the dagger away? Okay. Wrong one. I love armor! Awarding 1.3. Many a swordsman venture into the world with this treasure in mind. That's pretty cool. Hyper Warrior, you must be the hero everyone's talking about. Please take this. Nice! Free stuff? Thank you. Oh no! I thought that was like a uh, swordplay confusion that it applied it to the. Aww. How the heck? I can't get in there. But Young girl takes damage. Concerning. Hmm. Dang, if I had seen that, I would have gone for it.
Uh, hmm. I don't think I can safely open that one and be able to get away. I got nicely lucky with what I... What the heck was that? Okay. Love armor. Random items. Quality whetstone. Those are useful. Skull of analysis is also very useful. Okay. Your weapon dealer. Silver lance. Hmm. Whoa. That was weird. Just vacuumed everything up. Uh, let's put one of these in, in this fellow's pocket. As much as I'd like that axe, I can't. Continue. Not you, you. Longsword and longsword. Okay. Quality longsword <laughs> expensive. Oh, okay. I can just double my, my income real quick if I wanted. Hey there, Bucky. How's it going? Good to see you. Low energy pup gang. This time you're awake for the stream. You know, totally valid. Uh, if you crash out, you know, I might crash out too. We'll just, we'll, we'll, it'll turn into a just sleeping stream. And uh, it'll it'll be cozy. We'll we'll have hot cocoa and pop some popcorn. <laughs> when are we gonna do a, a combo glow dog uh, VR movie stream? Wow! Wow! All right, bud. One shot me from full health again for the second time tonight? What the heck? <laughs> uh, it was rough. Yep, that was a pretty solid run. Just keep up this pace and you'll save the world in no time. Will I? Will I save the world? You're down to collab. Collab a sleeping stream. <laughs> Oh, that's like actually talking about the mechanics of the healing rate in this. That's pretty cool. Light shield is revealed to be leather shield. Dimensional vaults. Oh, put that away. Put that away. Actually. That long sword is pretty nice. Oh, it's unfortunate that I don't have a repair scroll for that one. Let's put away one of the keys of seals. Apply. Do I have enough? Expand. I would need 165. Dang it, so close. Okay. <laughs> Alright. Um, let's see here. Do I want to do a different roguelike? We're doing like ADD gaming today. 
Uh, Half Minute Hero just wasn't doing it for me. And One Way Heroics is a delight of a game. But I also just played through the entirety of Dragon Quest 1, so... Let's see what else I've got stored into my, my little roguelike section. A total of 27 people follow this game. That's... that is certainly a thing. Uh, game capture... I don't even know where I got this one. I know, like, Humble Bundle, obviously, but... I don't know, like, what it was connected to in the first place that made me end up picking it up. Let's see, this'll go way down here. Just above a V-Ride. And we will close this. Okay. Uh, I forgot this game had split screen compatibility. That's fun. Silly little roguelike. Uh, using floaty falling mechanics. Having a bite of yellow curry, or not yellow, red curry between games here. legends speak of a great hero who will enter the portal at the Temple of Knowledge, then fight across many strange and fantastic lands in search of the holy sanctuary that holds a great secret to existence. Unfortunately, as you will soon find out... Well, one sec. Still a bit loud. Okay. Unfortunately, as you'll soon find out, the problem with ancient prophecies is that everyone thinks the prophecy is about them, especially in a land of epic adventure and bloodthirsty monsters. This is the story about the tragic and largely unnecessary deaths of the many heroes who thought that they were the great hero of prophecy, but sadly and fatally were mistaken. It's also a stor the story about the one hero who did make it. thing that made all of the D&D isomorphics possible to play. <laughs> Which D&D games did you play? Because I played most of the first person party ones like um, Eye of the Beholder. Plus to dodge, plus to damage. Uh, we'll do. 
I like the arrows. Oh no! Wait, for five coins? And I can just do this for free? Since I have no money? That's interesting. Okay. Huh. Spear, plus to range, plus to knockback, minus 20% damage. We'll do that one. Okay. Ah! <clears throat> I'm a monk of knowledge, and I'll be your guide. This is the temple where you begin your grand adventure. I've played the game, thank you! Pacifist. Uh... Clowns. X to strike. And Z to throw daggers. In two different directions at once. That's a new one. Uh-huh. New ability. Fast strike. Well, I will have to get it. Yeah. I've played this... I have, like, a lot of hours in this game. Could you stop doing that? Please! Uh... Recharge your ability to full. No keys. An archer. What do we got over here? A box? No, that counted as a kill! Fine. Oh, okay. Pine Shaker is dead. Well, that's unfortunate. We want arrows instead of daggers, because arrows can be recovered, daggers cannot. Reroll. Baldur's Gate and Icewind Dale, mostly. I really... I wish that I enjoyed... Um, honestly, I wish that I enjoyed more of Baldur's Gate in general, because it's a very sweet and endearing game. But to be honest, Dungeon Siege did a better job at being a D&D game without even trying to, like, align itself in any way with D&D or any other property. Uh, Dungeon Siege 3 was, like, everything that I wanted Baldur's Gate to be. Shrine of Keys. Activate this shrine to spawn two enemies and gain a key. Liked Icewind Dale much better. I, I don't even know like what the game, what Icewind Dale was or had. What's this? Gray statue. If you have no keys, breaking a chest or door will work too. Okay. Activate this shrine to spawn four enemies and gain 25 experience. Cool. New power, Confusion. For future heroes, turn all visible enemies against each other. This effect is permanent. Huh. You rescued a captured ally. A recaptured ally has a special ability that helps you in a different way. When your hero gains enough experience, he or she gains a level. Leveling up instantly restores your hero to full health, as well as increasing your hero's damage. Very nice. New trait, Keymaster. Start with five keys. Nice. Oh no, that that ruined my pacifist run. Hey there, Busta. How's it going?
Let's see. Just got home. How's the day been? Emotional, but doing all right. I got my uh, laptop upgraded, so I'm feeling pretty good about that. Wait, what? Oh, they critted against me. I forgot the demonic rogue is so powerful. Hmm. Huh. Daggers, arrow, clones, mega jump. Let's just do this one again. But this time, this time, Monk of Time, total unlocks. Pacifism. Peace orbs grant experience. Get blessed with three clones. Teleportation Shrine, Apothecary. So is everything at 25? It is. Okay. Shrine of Shadow. Activate the Shrine to turn invisible for 10 seconds, allowing you to get past enemies unharmed. Ha! Shrine of Health. Damn it. Wait, what? Ah, I thought it was the clone. I'm really bad with the clones. I don't think they're working for me. Arrow, clone, ski master. Arrow, mega jump. What is your bow? Bow? Yes. Shrine of flames. Trigger a ring of fireballs in all directions. Do it. Are you kidding me? Okay, let's hire pacifism because I like the challenge. of blood you say spend five coins to gain one maximum damage for the rest of this turn all right also we have so many keys because we started with key master I feel stronger
Go back up to the top. Whoop. Hmm. And the experience is something you can only get, like, a certain amount per run. So you kind of got to go for it when you can. Looks like they may have also fixed some of the uh, issues that this game had where you wouldn't be able to actually like collect all of your arrows as a ranger sometimes. about it. Also, Windbringer is a great name for a little ranger. Level 2, Strange Statue. You're in for a surprise. Every single minion flies. Oh, great. Visit the apothecary to upgrade health. Okay. Even they fly, that's funny. I'm still technically on a pacifist run, and I don't know how. This is amazing. More of this, please. Oh, this is so silly. I love it. This never happens. safely down from here. Ah, no! Okay. Well, I think it's time for me to... <sighs> yep. Yep. Don't really want that. I hate this. Finder. Hmm.
the clones have been interesting. Let's do... We'll stick with the one we got. Windbringer beans, now in large cans. <laughs> Additional monk. Pacifism runs are fun. You just destroyed the shrine! You bastard! I forgot you do that! I have to, like, turbo my way through here. Oh my god. Omni Slash. Rapidly teleports and kills visible enemies in a short... Okay, well, that's cool. Gems. More enemies and gems. And we destroyed the past with them. Party! back. So one thing that's uh, really tough about the archer is that like you can actually lose all of your arrows and there's no way to get them back. not count against oh well, <laughs> well, I guess it doesn't matter if I get killed hmm the gamer ADD is real though like what else what else what else what else missed me hmm Note that I'm getting less and less far in the game, but I'm still getting more money. That's because of the pacifism orbs.
Please don't kill the wizard. Come on, man. You're terrifying. Look at this goblin hiding from... Glad I got that plus 10 max health. Shine of Shadow. The burning smell, that flaming stench, the fires here are hard to quench. You don't say. Hmm. Apparently that destroyed my uh, pacifist run. Knockback. Melee strikes knock targets back further. Sounds good. Hmm, that is a lot of fire. Those fires! <laughs> Good name. Dragon Cloak, also a bow user. Even more pacifism. Gosh, this place is really green. Aw, that's sweet of them to notice. Okay, good. None of these shrines are not allowed yet. Gain one max damage the rest of the run. Sure. What else? No! Why? Why did that happen? Okay, well, that's the end of that. Let's do it. Now we get to do the murder run. God, I love the Shrine of Sparks. Ooh, don't want that one, though.
Ah. Uh, 50 coins. Good. Is that all of them? Yep, that is all of them. Strange statue. What does this one say? Ah, uh, more fire. Delightful. So much fire. <sighs> You've unlocked Agile. You can double jump and move 25% faster. You love fire. Well, right now fire's causing me some problems. I was immediately destroyed. Ugh. Hmm. Cute game. Definitely had enough of that. Let's see. I think we're going to take a short break here so that I can take care of various biological needs. We're going to turn on some No Thoughts Head Empty music. And I will be right back. See you folks in about five minutes. Always the one starting and tending the fire. I mean, that's same. I love tending fire when I'm like out doing camping and stuff. If you folks have not yet done so, please refill your waters and take a break to go use the restroom. Drucci Drake, yes. This is good. This is true. This is correct. Whoever switched my uh, my category because I spaced it and somehow it still ended up in the right spot. So thank you, whoever it was that did that. Still figuring out exactly what I, what I want to play here.
One of these days, I'm going to have to get some people together to play um, Interplanetary. The game is weird. It's by the same people that did Worms. Also, why is my music so loud? Why is everything so loud tonight? Like... Was I going deaf last night and just turned everything up? What what happened here? <laughs> if you changed every category, you would surely also forget. <laughs> hmm. <laughs> I think we're going to play a game that I've definitely sunk some time into. Uh, looks like about 40 hours almost, out of 32 hours. But uh, I don't remember it. Like, I know that I've played it, I know I know how to play it, but it has been so long since I've played it that I don't actually remember this game. Also, last night we started with uh, playing Metroid 1 for the NES. I think, I think, I might actually play uh, Zero Mission here on stream. But I have to make certain I can find where the hell I stored it. Never mind, I know exactly where it is. I just have to get to it. Before we get to that point... I must roll myself a thing because it is that time. It's always great when there's more flour on the outside of your grinder than the inside. <laughs> Just Colorado problems, I suppose. Thing time. Look, I'm trying not to upset the uh, the Bezos that be, but I live in a place where I can go do this right on my front porch. I am tempted to put concentrate on this, but I also have a pen that I could be sipping off at any point. I need to remember that more often because I wear it and it runs into things all the time. Like I'm aware that it's there, but I tend to forget that it's a thing that can supply me medicine the same way that like carrying around an inhaler in your pocket isn't going to remind you that like, oh, hey, if you're having trouble breathing, you can use this. It's just there. It's just part of your inventory at that point. In my case, I have to have both. Although it would be really cool if I could actually hang my inhaler off of my neck the same way I do my vape. I'd probably lose it a lot less. Dog brain! Dog brain! Okay. Mouthful of flour. Cheers! Okay. Now I am going to try out doing crown takers here on stream. And again, we're going to have to mess with audio levels again. because This is going to go crunch. All right. OBS, new game source. Capture. This one goes just after Cosmic. Okay. 
again, I have not seen this game in a very long time, so I don't quite remember what I'm doing, but we're going to find out. How's the in-game audio on this look? Oh. Okay. Seems cozy. Wait, 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 wait. Undead Undertaking? There's been... Huh? Also, hello, Mike. There we go. She stopped detecting I was talking. Undead Undertaking. There appears to be an expansion pack that I received for this and I didn't know? Easy. All experience acquired by the hero and mercenaries during previous games is kept. You no longer need to defeat the boss at the end of each level. Normal is the true gameplay experience. Each mercenary starts the game at level 1. You need to defeat the boss at the end of each level. You must gather your party before venturing forth. Welcome to the lands of the Duke of Azire. You are still some leagues away from the Duke's castle, but take care. Your adventure begins here. Inside a room at night, our hero is sleeping peacefully in his bed. <laughs> mm, it must be him. Wake up, son. Oh, no. uh, who's there? Don't worry, it's me, your father, King Landric of Ares. I am speaking to you in your mind. What? My father? King Landric in my mind? Yes, I am your father, and all those who share my blood have the ability to talk to one another telepathically. That's it, I'm going crazy. Calm down. I'm using what little remains of my vital strength to do this, so listen carefully. If you are probably aware, Duke Thomas of Esai has betrayed and deposed me. He is holding me captive in his dungeon as we speak. The dreadful wars between our armies have weakened the Duke's forces, if only for a short time. So it would be possible for a small group of to infiltrate his castle and free me. But I'm a nobody. I can barely plant turnips here at the farm. The blood of many great generals flows in your veins. I trust you completely. Your brothers have failed, but you will succeed. If you free me, I will reward you beyond your wildest dreams. And maybe one day my throne will be yours. Please hurry before the Duke executes me. My son, you are my only hope. Hero. This this character looks like a dweeb. <laughs> Strength 4, critical 10, dodge 10, accuracy 95, move 3, range 1. Hero is not subject to melee penalties, allows positions to be swapped as a mercenary. Okay. Your house. Your team. An ordinary egg to stored room temperature. A map. Okay. Hail to you, hero. If you're coming to talk to me, it means you can see me. And if you take an interest in my humble self, you must be a beginner. Instead, my explaining how, instead of explaining how every single thing works, I'll let you discover things by yourself. And if you have questions, I will answer them. So now that the king needs him, yeah. What can I help you with? You will learn. Okay, yeah, I get, I get the idea. This is your house. You already knew that you were going to miss it after a few days. Search. Despite the obvious poverty of the place, a few surprises await you. Two gold, a toughness potion. Nice. Cloth. Nice. Speed potion. Teleports to the destination instead of walking there until the end of the current turn. Plus two movement range until end of turn. Take everything. Okay. Whoa. Whoa! Okay. Next to your torch's flickering glow, you can find the entrance of the cave. It is wide enough to let your group inside. There are no signs of human or animal life inside the cave, and there are no plants either. It serves as good shelter, nothing more. 
You storm the place, breaking the branches of the trees and digging the ground until you eventually find treasure. Iron? Armor rune? Gruyere? Uh, that cheese seems concerning to steal, but okay. A cottage. It may not be a fancy inn, but that small house in front of you will be perfect for taking shelter from the rain. The complete lack of furniture and spiderwebs covering the walls and ceilings suggests that the building has not been occupied for a while. Book. Fish. <clears throat> Unexpected cough took me. Uh, okay. Exhaust. 5% accuracy. How's it going, Jarvie? It's good to see you. Wolves. Some beasts have already made this place their home, and you haven't frightened them all. Get ready to fight. It goes. We are playing a game that I forgot to change the title of. I, I did it again. I did it again. I changed the games, and I forgot to change the title. So, this one is Crown Takers. Bear with me, my allergies are kicking my ass. Aw, Basta, thank you! <laughs> enjoy the, uh, the gift sub there, Jarvie. And enjoy the emotes. All the sparkle hearts. Okay. Uh, crown takers, and then tell us to actually change it this time. Yes? Yeah, yeah, good job. <laughs> Oof. Also, I still need to go in and uh, edit that. So, combat. How do combat work? Melee attack attacks an adjacent unit. A potion. Disguise. Guard. Allows you to retaliate on the next attack. Ends turn. Use. Guard from this way. Enemy turn. Oh no. Well. Counterattack. Oh, still works. That's cool. Your turn. Stab. Wolf defeat. Hero. Loading. Need to be eaten, that's the way of the world. You've just proven that you're still at the top of the food chain. A blacksmith. According to the site in front of the forge, the blacksmith offers his services 24-7. You have many options available at the blacksmiths. Mm -hmm. Weapon rune, plus one strength, plus 20 critical... Minus half accuracy of ring rune. Huh. Improve your weapon. Add runes to your equipment to upgrade it. That gives it a rune slot. Okay. Okay. Well, that's cute. So, buy that, buy that, we already have the armor rune, close, back to the blacksmith, put that in here, put this in here, put this in here. I had no idea I could do all this in this game, it's kind of neat. Got some gold. Agility Potion, Speed Potion, Toughness Potion. Huh.
There's nothing to do here. So once you've rested, that's it. Okay. Use fish on the hero. We ate some fish. Step two. Go to the land of the Duke of Essar. What a cute little game. Melodar. Why, hello, traveler. Would you seem... Would you have some time to spare? I'm requesting your help. I need to free a noble damsel, my sister, who is being held hostage by the Duke's soldiers. She's suffering the consequences of supporting King Yandrick at the dawn of the Grey War. That, an answer wo that is an answer worthy of a true knight. Let us be on our way. We have no time to lose. Okay. A small inn welcomes travelers looking to eat or rest for the night. You have many options available. Mercenary. Interesting. Defensive stance. Taunt. Hunter. Ooh. Interesting. Sure. Necropolis merchant. Hmm. Huh. Close that. Arm wrestling. Among other things, you could try your medal against a local arm wrestling champion. Resurrection scroll. Lockpick. Yes, please. Meat. I'll take that too. Inkeeper. We rent a room. We are becoming tired. Let's do some arm wrestling. You lost two gold. Unfortunately, the local contender is a true colossus, and Halfurus's hand has been mercilessly bested. That's cute. Ah, oh, the blacksmiths. As a merchant, what do you offer? Same thing. Critical hits inflict three additional damage. Reduce skill cooldown by one. So there's different runes one could pick up. That's neat. Okay. Well, leave. There's an imposing tower alongside the pass. It allows the garrison to secure the surrounding era, area and acts as their camp. The tower's been cleared out, and it's hard to tell in the last time it housed visitors. In any case, it looks clean, and there's no holes in the roof. Among all there is to examine, you finally find some objects. Tools, toughness potion, and a bravery potion. Take it all. It is ours now. In the pale moonlight, you make out a tiny cottage not far from the pass. An old blacksmith looks at you in a suspicious way as you enter. Still, he invites you to take a look at his wares. Hmm, iron. Cloth. Leather. Increased to level 2. Increased to level 3. Oh. Let's sell some tools. I think we're going to sell these potions, too. Tempting to buy that leather, but we'll go for the gold instead. How much is the leather? Two. Uh -oh, I'm right. Sell that. Buy that. Okay, this is only a shop. Whoa. A lost adventurer. Would you like to visit a region filled with adventures and mysteries? You will not regret such an adventure, believe me. I'm not ready yet, but I will be. Oh yes, I will. Oh wow, that rail guard looks difficult. As you get closer, you see some armed men running towards you, weapons at the ready. Your turn. Interesting. Okay. 45% chance. That's terrible. Missed. Oof. 
You get a two attacks per round. Interesting. You get one shot per round. Okay. Enemy's turn. That ring is not a good ring. Oh, dang. You got pushback. I guess... Try... Try and stab that one. One. Do it again. Very nice. I don't know what happened, but good job. You prevailed once again, and the last of your opponents falls motionless to the ground. Stealth and toughness. Huh. It may not be a fancy inn, but that small house in front of you would be perfect for taking shelter from the rain. Rest. This is so cute. I don't remember this game having, like, all these fancy little animations and cards in between. This is very charming. Create a diversion. The howls you can hear indicate the places you are about to reach is a lair of wild beasts. Oh, I forgot to heal the archer. Oops. Ah, woo! Very nice. Oh, that was it. Okay. Good job, bud. Eat or be eaten. That's the way of the world. And a health potion. And a castle. We got an apple and a weapon room and a toughness potion. Also, what's this? Ah. More strengths. Oh, having starting gear is also useful for the other characters that you choose. I see. Okay. Oh, nice. Can I have multiple things in the suit of armor? Hmm. All right. Do you? You. Hmm. Ah. Step three. Step three. What's the castle? You hear a low and deep breathing. Suddenly, a hulking black wolf emerges from the bushes a few steps in front of you, followed by other smaller wolves. The wolf lord and his pack are on the hunt, and they've just found their prey. Ow! <laughs> Alright. Stab. Dodge. Counterattack. Very nice. Miss, but you still counterattack, so good for you.
Opportunity. That's what the exclamation means. Okay. Else. Speed. Invisibility. Next attack. Cannot miss, and it cannot be dodged. Hmm. Oh no. I should not have done that. Good shot, lol. Tactics. <laughs> that archer. Eventually, with the formidable beast collapses, st staring at you with tremendous rage as death slowly paralyzes. Go poo. Alright, so... That has nothing to do here. Once you stay at a place, that's that's the only chance that you get. Interesting. We are taking that off. That half accuracy is terrible. Very nice. Short sword, level 3. And gold works on whoop, uh, armor or weapons, it looks like. But our main character is nicely outfitted. Plus the crit rate. Ooh. Also, drastically needs healed. Plus the crit rate. Plus the strings. Nice. See, what is step three? Go to the capital, Benim? What? One day has passed and your enemies have become stronger. So that's what the passage of time does in this. Yeah, let's, let's go to the necropolis, I guess. What are we doing? Boogeyman's Inn. A small inn welcomes travelers looking to eat or rest for the night. We keep unless you rent a room. Waitress has lockpicks and cheese and resurrection scrolls. The merchant has a mirror. When Halfers has his mirror, he's much more powerful and charismatic, too. Poetry. Sitting close to the fireplace, a few endlessly inspired minstrels are having a rhyming contest. Halfers was lacking inspiration towards the end, and everyone noticed. Okay. You know what? Let's I don't understand. What's in the marsh? <laughs> the marsh in front of you is not very welcoming. 
The good news is you probably won't come across a lot of people here. You're knee-deep in muddy water, trying to keep moving when a dancing light suddenly shows up. It looks like some fire running on water. The creature comes to you and starts talking. It's a will-o'-the-wisp. The creature is bored to death in the marsh with no one to play with. You decide it's a good time to take a break and play with the will-o'-the-wisp. So very happy that when you leave, it tells you where to find some mushrooms. The most intriguing mushroom. Skeletons. As you recognize the sound of blades being unsheathed, you know fighting is imminent. Oh, wow. There's so many of them. Ugh. My poor archer. Dodge. Counterattack. Stab. Very nice. Oh, no. Oh, no. All of the archers. Oh, no. Uh, how do... Well, we have a new set of problems. Stab. A snack of opportunity. Speaking of, I should actually have some of my food here. Stab again. You know you want to. Yeah, we did it. <clears throat> so next, guard in this direction. Like I don't think it's gonna help, but You prevailed once again, and the last of your opponents falls motionless to the ground. Take it all. I never bought that scroll of Resurrect. I thought I did, but I didn't. Oh no.
selling these mushrooms. I do appear to have pretty much lost this run, though. Oh. Wait a sec. We may still be able to resurrect the mercenary. One day has passed. That's fine. Merchant. No, not you. You. Hey. Hey. Nice. All right. Cause I like that guy. He's way cooler than the than the main character, uh, in in every way. <laughs> Another will of the wisp. You decide it's a good time to take a break. Amanita Vaginata. Yeah? Yeah? A group of peasants to fight. More marshland. You have water almost up to your hips. You find it very hard to advance. And just you're thinking, you think... Couldn't get any worse, you meet a peasant. Just by looking at his emaciated face and his muddy, saggy cloth, you know he's been lost in the marsh for hours, maybe even days. You agree to let the peasant follow you. By walking straight ahead, you know you'll manage to find an exit from this muddy maze. About twelve hours later, you were, re you were happy to see you were right. The peasant bursts into tears and gives you all of his belongings to thank you. That's terrible. Well, time to go kill his family. Fifteen? Whoa! Whoa. Increases range by one tile, but that wouldn't help in this case. That qualifies as an attack of opportunity. Hmm.
Very nice. Did they turn into fish people? <clears throat> the last of your enemies hits the ground with a death rattle. You won't die today, it seems. <laughs> Ruin Church. The church in front of you must have been glorious in the past. Some secret may still be hidden here for you to discover. You were wondering where the monoliths of the Plains of Eris had come from. You have your answer. A bunch of strange clerics praying to some god with an unpronounceable name are busy sculpting some black marble rock. Let's help them. You help the clerics that are evil creation. The influence of the finished monolith makes you lose some health, but you are handsomely rewarded. church in front of you must have been glorious. An awful smell assaults your nostrils as you enter. It seems the excrement of the surrounding area is all dumped here. Soon you see a creature coming out of the dark. It looks like an ibex, but with the tail of a fish. Huh. Despite the obvious poverty of the place, you find mushrooms. 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 The Skeleton King? Okay. Ah. Well, that's a problem. Back to the inn, I guess. Keep getting this poor guy killed. I forgot I was wearing makeup today. <laughs> I look really cute right now. That's fun. Hey there, Ryan Gosling. How was anime night? Hmm. Did I ever go into this one? Oh, I, I guess I did. Those are the two churches. So now we fight the skeleton game. A skeleton is far more impressive. A skeleton far more impressive than the ones you've met before is blocking the path. Behind it, you can see a portal that looks like the one that led you into this strange land. It's easy to imagine what's going to happen next. Did you really expect to disrupt the souls resting in the Acropolis and leave as if nothing had happened, especially when you were all skin and bone? Can I just leave? Oh, okay. Should have known.
guys. Put you back into Overwatch. Facing this way. You attack him. And then also go into Overwatch, but guard forward. This archer is about to gain so much experience. Uh, apparently that counterattack only counts towards the first... Oh, we might be about to lose again. Spooky. I forgot that the hero has backstab. Last of your remaining enemies. Okay, cool. Cool, 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 cool. More health. Everybody needs way more health than they have. Go to the capital, Berlin. I suppose so. You face the portly man with a cheerful face. Judging by his clothing, he could be someone important. An evil glow burns in his eyes in total opposition to his friendly manner. Good day to you, proud adventurer. A little, bird, a little bird told me your quest, and you definitely need my help. I offer to provide you right away with a decent sum of gold to help finance your expedition. You can repay me later at an interest rate that is more than acceptable. You decline his generous offers most gracefully. You're a cautious person, and this character doesn't inspire confidence. You notice a small end to one side. Another mercenary. What's this? Dark Binding, Dark Pact. Azure the next attack and heals for two health. Self-inflicts one damage per attack during your turn. Hmm. Attacks the unit behind the main target, too. Attacks an attack that knocks back target's hit. No. Wait, 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 what, what? Variants? Hold on. Self-inflicts two damage and heals an ally. Deal twice your missing health as damage. Nearby allies cannot be attacked. An attack that deals three bonus damage to target's hit. <laughs> These are so cool. I'm taking the demon. Waitress. These are forever going to come in handy. We can buy a campfire and keep it in our pocket. Okay. Yeah, he needs food badly. Cool. A house? In the pale moonlight, you can make it a tiny cottage not far from the bath. Two skeletons are lying in the only room of the house you're in. Something must have happened here a long time ago. And no one seems to have worried about it. We search. We get some leather, a strength potion, and tools. <clears throat> that could be a good magic item, actually. A pocket fire? Yeah! I like the idea of it as, like, a second edition D&D-style item. Like, um, are you familiar with the folding boat? Like, <laughs> in the original uh, DM's guide. It's so fun. 
Uh, it's actually like one of the first things I rendered as a as a digital art piece was figuring out the exact dimensions of what the folding boat was and like what its uh water draw and weight limit and how many people it could hold and all that. Turns out the folding boat like starts out as a rowboat, but it actually can be used as a full on sailboat. Like not just a not just a sailboat, but like an a decent cog. Like up to ten tons. Because nothing's written correctly. Behind the curtain of pouring rain, you can make out the outline of a watchtower. Maybe the healthy stone walls of the garrison will provide you some shelter until the rain stops. A strange looking woman is inside the abandoned tower. After scrutinizing you, she eventually invites you to look at her wares. Ooh. We already have two cloth. Need one iron. And if I want to get. Oh, 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 oh. Nice. You drastically need the extra armor. Use a staff. Interesting. Plus three max health. Hey, that's pretty nice. Plus to crit rate. Plus to even better crit rate. Crits deal three additional damage. Plus to dodge. All right, let's leave. You need dodge. Oh, wait. <laughs> this is the person that we put these on at. Whoops. Wow. Okay. Well. A thick layer of dust covers the furniture. The place looks unoccupied and quite unlikely to offer anything of interest. Well, you were wrong. Plus 35% crit rate, and then crits deal additional damage. We already know he does a decent crit rate. I need... Oh no! Go back! I need to stop forgetting that this is the place that I put these in place. Wow. Okay. Now we can go. Round tower. Seems you're interrupting the tower soldiers in the middle of a game of cards. They haven't recognized you and even invite you in to join them. Seems your arrival was expected because you can hear a stampede coming your way. Hmm. Got an action point back for that. Very nice. That consistently happens? I'm intrigued. Hmm. 
Absorb the next attack and heal for two health. Provides a bonus to dodge, allows you to retaliate. I didn't want to do that with either of these. This isn't a way out. Oh well. Get shot, lol. Slash. Miss. Stab. Rinse, die, repeat. What the heck? Oh, she's still being blocked. I'm a fool. Tommy's being a jerk. I'm so sorry, hon. Health potion. We're gonna need that. Hovels. As you move closer to the ruined house, you notice the walls are shaky and literally covered with ivy, and some of the beams have collapsed. A terrible fire destroyed the building, which has partly collapsed. No one has come here for a long time, although some traces suggest the place housed visitors in search of shelter. Hmm. 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 Got an armor rune, an agility potion. We're heading back to the blacksmith then. Play cards. As the veterans around the table are more skilled than you, you lose your bet. Well, we all know gambling's a bad thing. Plus to crit rate. Nothing that I actually want to sell. I was wrong. I found things I wanted to sell. You need more health. Actually, no. You need more health. Plus a crit. Crit rate good. You eat. Very good. We continue our journey. More thieves. Fight.
Yo! Not cool. <clears throat> what a small area. Thank you for the hydrate. I has water right here. Uh, and along with that, I also have a brownie. Nom 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 nom. <laughs> now strength and agility potion. One day has passed and your enemies grow stronger. Hmm. Everybody's back at full health. Let us begin. Very nice. Oh, I didn't see that one. Oh no. Assassins everywhere. Very nice. 
They're all 90%. Let's just use Overwatch instead. Okay, you are in some trouble. Okay, that helps. decided we should meet. The massive castle built before you was built to stand the test of time and obviously belongs to a rich lord. You need to find out whose side the lord has decided to support. You're introduced to the lord. Challenging him is a risky bet, but it could lead to your, that could lead to your early demise. Yet if you do manage to win, the rewards would surely be powerful. Knock out all that armor. Hit the overwatch. This direction. Very nice. Oh no. Zero. Okay.
Nice. So what do we get? A compass. Important location is displayed on the map. Currents of the kingdom. Go on, go on, go on. More dodge. More crit. Let's see. They got us enough coin to do some things. We need to go to the end, though. Hello, banker. Halfers didn't win the game, and it probably isn't a good idea to give it another go. Oops. Kill everyone for two health. Do it again. A tall, skinny man leading a small band of soldiers is walking towards you, his sword drawn. Upon reaching you, the soldier orders you to stop. So you're the troublemakers who've been scouring the land. I'll eliminate you with my secret technique. Oh no! Very nice. What? The critical did one damage. Delightful. They had like anti crossbow armor. Seems that Sheer ran out of secret techniques. Cute. Uh, you need dodge because you went 0% previously. Except for. Go to the capital, Benim. I thought we were already there. You notice a small end to one side. Area North Sengo.
Hmm. Ooh, all adjacent units, you say. Maldo doesn't care about anyone or anything except her pierced wooden doll. I sincerely doubt all these breaks serve your purpose. Maybe I like hanging out with two folks. The building you went to is being repaired by a couple who hopes to settle in on the place. They'll probably welcome your help. Well, we'll come back. <laughs> may not be a fancy inn, but the small house in front of you may be perfect for taking shelter from the rain. Strength potion. Take everything. So we can help these folks with a strength potion? Yeah. After a hard day of work, the couple rewards you properly. More royal guard. Blacksmith. You. No runes, though. Steel armor. Looks one damage at end of turn. That's terrible. Fight. Much heavier than expected. Hmm. She's very injured. Whew. To be honest, folks, I'm very, very tired. I might actually call it for the night. I know that I've been doing these shorter streams, but it's, I've been very, very tired lately. I don't know what's going on with that, but um, I've been kind of crashing. Yeah, very sleepy puppy. I can hear it in my own voice too, and I'm just like, I've been fighting it for a minute, but uh, I don't even think playing a different game or anything would like change at any. Let's go ahead and back out of this. Oh, I can't save him, but... Well, I guess I'll just Alt F4. Whoa! I can quit whenever I want. And I just did. <laughs> um, let me jump over here real quick. Ba -ba 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 -ba. Yeah, thank you everybody. Whoa, why is my avatar so weird right now? Hello? Oh, it's because she's over here. There we go. Oh, it's showing the wrong version. 
That's interesting. Um, yeah, thank you everybody for dropping in tonight, and thank you for everybody hanging out in the chat. Thank you for all those that are watching in the background, and for everybody that's gonna tune into the VOD later. I super appreciate all of you. Oh, I expect I'm probably gonna be doing some collab stuff tomorrow, but I have no idea because uh, I don't plan ahead very well right now. A uh, little scrambled. It's been trying to focus on getting other stuff put together for the stream lately, and it's kind of been chewing up. Yeah, yeah, same. Good night, Jarvi. I hope that you have a good night. Uh, I hope you rest well. But, yeah, uh, if if we don't end up doing collab stuff, I don't know, maybe I'll end up doing more of the, the Signal story and see if I could try and get that secret ending. I don't know. We'll see. We'll find out. We've also got testing to do on this new RAM setup. Holy cow, this is loud. I don't even like this track that much. Let's see. Move, move, move that along. Um, but yeah, I'd also like to actually test out how well the current RAM load will handle Diablo 4. Because I realized that um, that may well have been part of what was messing with things in addition to having like thermal issues in general so hopefully we can get that fixed hey thank you jarvi i will absolutely do so as soon as i'm i'm done for the night um oh wait no no we we got the pen we got the pen cheers folks hope you're able to imbibe along whether it's smoking vaping or dabbing tinkers edibles tonics or sows but um yeah, I just, I don't want to be doing this when I'm super, super low energy and not putting forward the best foot that I can for it. And we've we've at least hit the usual three hour marks that I tried to go for for you. So I'll be back tomorrow, hopefully a little bit higher energy and a little bit less wonky in the head. And let's find out who we want to raid for tonight. Who's, who's currently on? Uh... You know what? I could use the pep up. Let's go ahead and send everybody over to say hi to all dudes. And we'll do a green glow dog raid. All right, folks, thank you so much. I hope to see you again tomorrow. We'll be starting about 9 p.m. Mountain Standard Time. Uh, if not, we'll let you know if anything changes. See you soon. Mm -hmm. Love you all. <laughs>